Mikey here with Mycology Farms. Today I want to talk to you about grain to grain transfers, which are some of my absolute favorite ways to reproduce grain spawn tenfold even. So what I like to do is I have some blue oyster mushroom spawn right here. We're going to break it up. And I always like to do this in front of the flow hood, even though you can inoculate blue oyster mushrooms in open air, it doesn't hurt to just be a little safer and a little cleaner and do it in front of the flow hood. I like to use this Mylar grow tent as my lab space. It works fantastic. And I have some wild bird seed here that I pressure cooked yesterday, 90 PSI for 15 minutes, and let it sit overnight, kind of cool off. And now we're gonna add just a little bit of grain spawn. It doesn't take much at all. And then we'll seal the bags, put them up. I kind of like to wipe everything down with alcohol, no matter what. Again, it just doesn't hurt to be safe. Sometimes things contaminate and you don't expect it to. It can come out of nowhere and be really frustrating. want to get inside every fold, every little crease. Doesn't hurt to keep doing your hands as well. We'll open our spawn. Literally just that little bit. You don't even have to have that much. I don't know how well you can see it. But I'll get the bag sealed, then break it up further and mix it up really good. Just a few seconds on here. And make sure the seal's good. We're good to go. So I'll break that up just a little bit more. Mix it up real good. And then label. Today is the 29th, so... Blue. 29. And it's really that simple. It's going to take about two weeks and then we should be good to go. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the content. I'll talk to you soon.